Hi, Kev Edwards Sim Rally here. Today we're going to be doing a long term review of the Sparco R383 Rally Rim. Um, for those people who like a quick review and want to know whenever to just go out and buy this or not, then the quick answer is yeah, definitely. Now, I've been using this rim daily for around three months or so, so it's definitely had its fair share of use. The rim itself is covered in suede and it comes in at around 13 inches or 33 millimeter diameter. That's probably my favorite feature of this rim. It's a great size that gives a real authentic feel, which it should do to be fair since it's a 1v1 one, one one replica. It really does add to the immersion, especially while playing rally titles. And it's an awesome addition to the Thrustmaster ecosystem. The wheel itself feels absolutely solid. It's really durable. And you probably need arms like Schwarzenegger to get any bend out of it at all. So you can be confident when it comes to throwing this thing around hairpins and the like. Now, one thing I would say. I haven't used gloves with this rim. So the suede has worn really quickly where I hold the wheel. To the point where it's actually quite slippy in the hands. But to be fair, that's probably my own fault. Although I could imagine that that would annoy a lot of people, especially people who like to sell stuff on and recoup some of the money. The only other downside is the directional button. If you've got big sausage fingers like I have, then this will get annoying really quickly. You have to be really accurate when you're with your inputs otherwise you just you just keep changing options that you don't mean to change especially annoying when changing car setups and you accidentally change suspension setups without noticing little things like that the other buttons are all fairly decent nice positive click to them and you get the job done same with the flappy paddles nice and positive uh, and you can adjust them as well so you can actually bring them out or put them further in depending on the size of your hands the only other thing worth mentioning is the dye on the wheel will cause your hands to turn black if you, if you do choose not to wear gloves. It can be quite stubborn to wash off as well, but if you, it will stop happening after a month or so of, of good use. So, final thoughts. Absolutely fantastic wheel. That will make rallying a hell of a lot more immersive, but you are going to want to wear gloves if you want to protect the suede for longer and maybe use your keyboard to navigate the menus if the directional button annoys you as much as it does me. So there it is in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like and subscribe buttons and I'll see you on the stages. Take it easy.